Gotcha. Gotcha. And are you on treatment for your blood pressure? Yes, I am. What do you take? Do you know? um, HCTZ. Yeah. Take that. Hydrochlorothiazide. That's, that's a and, diuretic. Yeah, yeah. That's what it's, I think it's 25 milligrams it 25? a day. And then I take another one. Do you one. take it? Yeah, I do take pretty it. Pretty much, pretty regular? Yes. That's the only medication you take? Well, I take, I, I have an, another one. It's um, these long names I'm not good with. Mm. Lysa propanol. Lys Lysinopril. Yeah, I think that's it. Probably. Yeah, 10 milligrams. Okay. Once a day. Okay. And I take a baby aspirin. Oh, you do? Once a day. And how long have you been taking the aspirin? Uh, I think I started taking that shortly after they told me I had the high blood pressure. Yeah. About nine years. So, so you have a physician who has known you for a, for a while. Though. Yes. Has your blood pressure been under good control? Yes, it has. So you've never had headaches from that? No. So this headache isn't anything. No, it doesn't make you think of. Blood no, pressure. it doesn't. Okay. No. Gotcha. So you've been. Anything else to tell? Any other? The only problems? other medications would be the Tylenol and Advil. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Tylenol is about, you said eight a day. Eight a day. And then the ibuprofen, you call it Advil. Yeah. Right? Um, and that's four times four. Four times, four. Nine, yes. Okay. That, is that all medications? That's Do you everything. take vitamins, no. iron, nothing like nothing that? Nothing else. And any other medical problems that you know of? Um, well, I had my knees replaced. I've oh. had um, back surgery in my lower back. Well, you've been through a lot, huh? I have been through a lot. When, did, when were these knees fixed? Uh, different times? Or? Different times. No, the knees were both done at the same time. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. um, they were done. The back surgery was first, then I had my knees, and then I actually broke my arm. Hmm. I had to have my arm fixed. Just so that I have a sense of this, how long ago did you have the knees replaced? The knees were replaced about two years ago. Two years ago. Huh? So you were 52 then, huh? Yes. Just got bad. Just got that bad you couldn't get around? Couldn't get around. It hurt to walk. Mm -hmm. Osteoarthritis, I mm -hmm. believe, is what they said it was. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. That must be. That's They're much better now. And more functional. You can yes. get around. Does, do they limit you at all? No. No. And obviously, they don't haven't bothered you since this accident, have they? No, they haven't. You didn't hit your knees on the dashboard. No, I did not. Gotcha. And then what? What did you have done with your back? Um, lower back. I think it was L four, L five, herniated disc. Mm -hmm. And that was in 1995. Mm -hmm. So nine years ago. So then you were about 45 then yes. too. Yes. Huh? So that's about when they discovered you had high blood pressure? Yes. Okay. Okay. Now I got you. And did that work? Did the surgery work? Yes. So that it really relieved the you. pain. No, any trouble since then? Um, my back is a little weak, I think, mm -hmm. um, but mm -hmm. certainly much better than what it was. I had the pain going down my leg, mm -hmm. um, the nerve pain, and that's all so gone. So it got one of the nerves to your leg? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Well, you got lots to tell. Got lots to tell. Yeah. Okay. They're the main things. Uh, just to pick your brain about a few more things. Okay. Any other hospitalizations? Uh, you've had the knees, the back, yeah. the appendix, um, the high the, hernia the, fixed. The hernia and then my broken arm. Mm -hmm. How'd you do that? I fell off a bicycle. Recently or a long time ago? Uh, it was about four years ago. You, it sounds like you stay active anyway, huh? I do stay active. That's good exercise for your knees to ride a bike. That's right. It sounds like it wasn't good for your arm. Huh? I haven't been back on it, though. <laughs> And was that a, how long did that to heal? That took probably a year before it really was completely healed. Mm -hmm. Was there a complication? Um, it was just both bones in here. I think the ulna and the radius were mm -hmm. shattered. Mm -hmm. oh, uh, so I had mm -hmm. plates and pins in there. So they were broken it's in several different places. And it was so badly swollen, it just, mm -hmm. it took a long time to get my mm -hmm. range of motion back. I, I never I did get it completely back. I see. But the knee, the back, and most of the arm doesn't limit you from doing the kind no, of work you do. No. That kind of thing. Huh? Uh, anything, any other surgeries or no. hospitalizations? Mm -hmm. no. Do you, I need to know, any allergies? Do you have any allergies to drugs, food? Uh, penicillin. I'm allergic mm -hmm. to penicillin. Mm -hmm. uh, that's the only drug that I know of. Mm -hmm. um, and no food allergies. What's your penicillin reaction? Um, I just, it makes me break out. Really? I break out, I mm -hmm. itch. Um, and was that something you got older or, or when you were a kid? I think I was first, my first reaction with that, I was a youngster. Mm -hmm. I, I don't remember. Mm -hmm. It seems like forever, though, since I've known that I've been allergic but to it. But once you've got that information, it's stuck. 
Yes. So you're pretty careful about yes. that. Yes. Okay. All righty. Any other medical things you think I should know about that you can think of that we don't haven't covered? No, we covered my high blood pressure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, now, if I can just get these headaches under control, mm -hmm. that would be I really will feel. Yeah. Control, sure. That would make me feel good. Yeah, we need we need to get this settled. That's a lot of headache. Yes. Yeah. Something's not right, and we'll okay. be figuring this out. A uh, few more things, to, if I can be sure and get some good back, some more complete background. Okay. Do you smoke? No. Don't smoke at all, huh? No, used to, but I don't anymore. Uh, you drinking then? Alcohol? Uh, three or four drinks a week. Do you? That's it. What's your pleasure? What do you drink? Oh, mostly beer. Mostly on the weekend. So it's not every day, it's no. about three or four per yeah. week then, huh? Gotcha. Yeah. Is that the way it's always been? Yes. Uh, I also want to know a little bit about your family. Okay. The healthy? What runs in your family line? Anything? Um, my younger brother, who is 45, has high blood pressure. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I have a sister who is 48, and she's healthy. Mm -hmm. Mom is 78 and has arthritis mm -hmm. pretty badly. Where? Where does she have hers? In her, hers is basically in her hands. Mm -hmm. It started mm -hmm. about 15 years ago. Um, hmm. And Dad died when he was 65 of lung cancer. That's when I quit smoking, when he was gotcha. diagnosed. Was he a smoking man? He was that a smoking man, too. yes. Oh, so you did smoke once? Uh, I did smoke uh, once, and when I quit at age 40. 40. Yeah. Just so I know, when did you begin? Oh, my goodness. How many years did you put in smoking? I probably smoked 20, 22 years. Mm hmm so you were started as a teenager then, huh? Yes. About 18 years old. Yeah. Huh? Gotcha. And then your dad died of lung cancer. So that's yeah. then that's when you decided that that's was enough of I that, decided, huh? Yeah. I quit then. Gotcha. Okay. It scared me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, family line outside of lung cancer, any other cancers? Prostate, breast, colon? No. Any of those things that we need to be nope. thinking about? None no. that I'm aware of. Uh-huh. Um, I think that's got mostly everything in that category. Uh, last thing I want to do, I need to kind of go through your body's organ systems so I can think about how everything else works. Is okay. that okay with you? Sure. Uh, and some of this might pertain to the accident you had. How's your vision? Um, my vision is good. I, I wear glasses mm -hmm. for reading and distance. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, my vision, when the head... I think that's got mostly everything in that category. Uh, Last thing I want to do, I need to kind of go through your body's organ systems so I can think about how everything else works. Is okay. that okay with you? Sure. Uh, and some of this might pertain to the accident you had. How's your vision? Um, my vision is good. I, I wear glasses mm -hmm. for reading and distance. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, my vision, when the headaches are really bad, mm -hmm. when they're really throbbing, um, I think I said before, it's hard for me to focus. Mm -hmm. It just, you know. And are things blurry, or it's more just a concentrating thing? Um, actually, blurry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you try to look at something, it's fuzzy. Yeah, when they're really at their worst. When the next to their bed. Yeah. And both eyes? Is that? Do you think it's both eyes? I think it's both eyes. I mean, I can't read the newspaper or anything like that when they're really bad. If the headache calms down, the vision gets better. The vision gets better. Have you ever had that trouble before with your vision? No. No. Does it make any difference whether you have your glasses on or off? No. And how about your hearing? How's that hearing? Hearing's okay. Okay. Yeah. Was that disturbed at all since the accident? No, no, no. I haven't noticed anything with that. So you can hear a phone conversation yes. when, when your wife talks to you from the distance? Yes. That kind of thing. Yeah. No trouble with that. Huh? How about things like taste and smell? Are they, are they normal? Normal. Can you smell yeah. usual hamburgers yeah. and food yeah. cooking, yeah. smoke and coffee? I haven't even thought of that, but I haven't had any... No trouble like anything? No change in gotcha. that. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Um, other things in the I'm sort of going from top to bottom mm -hmm. trouble swallowing no nothing like that mm -mm. Uh, if you eat do you have any trouble with that initiating a cough no occasional heartburn occasional. Um, how occasional oh, well, when I eat something really spicy mm -hmm. but if I do some roll aids or some tums it t seems to take care of it right away is that often once a week once a month once in a while. Once in a while. Once in a while. So not a regular thing. Huh? Not a regular.